Hi, we're here with another one of our au pairs who's shortly about to go back to her home country. So first of all, can you introduce yourself, please? Hi, I'm Simone Gordon. I'm 19 years old and I'm from Ireland, but I study in London. So, number one, why did you choose to come to China? Well, I had never been east before, so I thought, well, what an interesting way of experiencing a country through a, a local family. What have you experienced uh, here in China and living with a Chinese host family? What have I experienced? Um, gosh, what a big question. So many things. I think uh, I had a bit of a change from everyday school life and then we went on a trip to Mongolia and that, and that was fantastic. It's quite a common thing for uh, families to go away during the summer holidays. So yeah, that was amazing. So what did you learn about Chinese language and Chinese culture? Chinese culture, okay. First of all, the food is not like the Chinese food that you have back in, well, I can only speak for the UK, I suppose, but I loved it. It's delicious, really lots of vegetables. I'd say it was one of my favorite things about, about China was the, the food. And also, what I found interesting was not the differences, but how similar actually uh, family life was and it's it's not as foreign or different it certainly didn't feel like it after a while that strange anymore I think that was one of the most interesting things is how normal it felt after a while how comfortable I felt what about the cultural classes and cultural activities any particular ones stick in your mind yes the great wall was probably uh, one of my favorites it exceeded my expectations actually it was amazing why did you choose Operia to come to China with? Operia? Um, well, I, I wasn't recommended by a friend or anything like that. I just stumbled across it online. And after talking with Martin and Nancy, it just seemed like uh, a really welcoming and friendly environment to be brave and go off, you know, a few thousand kilometers and, uh, and live there for, for three months. I felt like it would be a good supportive environment. So yeah, that's why I chose it. And how would you describe your relationship with the other au pairs? The other au pairs, yeah, I mean, you get you get uh, close fast to, to people because you have this shared experience and uh, it really helps um, when you meet up with them to you know bounce off what's been happening in your host family and uh, give each other advice. And uh, yeah, I've had a really good time with them. Great, great banter. And on that subject, what about your what about your host family? My host family, oh, they've been great. I really, genuinely will miss them. They've uh, even with the language barrier. I was lucky. Well, my host mom speaks pretty good English, but the other members of the family, the the grandparents and the IE, they've all tried so hard to make me feel welcome in their home. Yet we don't speak a common language. So that's been. I think it's been a. Uh, a challenge at times, but I'm really grateful for them uh, being so understanding and accommodating to me. So what memories will you take back with you to home? I'd say the memory that stands out in my mind is uh, being uh, showered by the, the nanny when we were uh, camping out in Mongolia in the middle of a field. So yeah, because well, we had no showers, no running water and uh, it was an experience. It was an experience. So I'll take that one home and uh, shout out to, to Ai Chung Ai for that one. <laughs> Would you recommend the program and Operia to uh, your friends? Oh yeah, definitely. I think um, I had one friend that uh, studied here for a month uh, with the university and I don't think he got that immersion in the culture that I got. Um, so yeah, for sure. I think it's definitely worthwhile you learn a lot and it gets you thinking about things that you know in terms of family and, and childcare that you wouldn't have really thought about until you know maybe you were at that age in your 30s or whenever when you decided you wanted a family so yeah I definitely think it's worth doing definitely and one last message any last message to anyone thinking of coming to China I would say in yeah just give it your best shot definitely in the first week or two like it's 
give yourself time to adjust. Give yourself time to adjust. But yeah, just give it your all and you'll get a, a lot back from the family if you do. Thanks, Simone, and have a safe flight back home. Thank you.